Hey programmers, we have one last thing to do for this print extract report program and it's the extract portion of it. And the reason you do that is so that the payroll clerk, he doesn't have to key all these hours that's been keyed in all week long. He may have to key the salary people and, uh, and in my program uh, at work, you know, we've, I've got it where they ask the question, do you want to do salaried people too and it says yes or no and plus we have housing expenses because this is a church denominations headquarter where I work and so they say well do you want to do housing expenses but no one else in the world gets that but anyway I'm thinking about I'm not thinking about I am working on the payroll part of this in C sharp but it might just be too hairy to um, give a tutorial because you know you've got to have state tables and federal tables and it is really complicated but anyway we'll but you could at least, you know, know how to extract data and in case you needed it for something else. Well, anyway, so we created these uh, variables, text log, and we created a file name, which I put my data in a file called our summary docs text. And uh, you have to create a file stream and open it and then, you know, buffered and that kind of stuff. You can read it off the screen here. And then we already had this other stuff in here, we, but we commented it out. And basically every time you write a print line, you send an extract, you send a file to, you send a record to the extract file. Let's uncomment this. Uh-oh. That ain't going to work. All righty. So we've got this. Uh-oh. I do need to comment there. Uh, we got this write to text file just like we wrote the other stuff up there we're writing to our text file and then we have to force out the last one also because he won't print all on his own just like we forced that one out we forced this one out too okay and then you close it and you flush it and stuff you can you can read it off the screen so anyway this is the first time I'm running it I hope it works for us hmm I was wanting to do this so that I could just do it in Windows Media, but that PDF's going to pop up, so I'll have to do it in AVI, which takes so much longer to load on YouTube. Let's print. Okay, we're going to say save. Yes, maybe if I close it real quick, it'll load into Windows. Okay. Okay, close it. Maybe, maybe that'll load now. So now we're going to go into the... I should have already hit this up, but I didn't. C data, data, data. Okay, and there's our file. Let's open it up. <gasps> there it is. That's what it's supposed to look like. And the reason you might say want, I had beginning week and ending week in there also, and the reason I did that because uh, the, my payroll clerk he complained that you know when he uploaded the data some you know he didn't know what week he had pulled for or when we had it on the unix you know different people could use it but now that i've got on uh windows nt everything you know all the data file goes to their pc and stuff so there's less problems with other people getting in there running it and and things well, anyway that's going to be it for this lesson and uh next time we'll work on something else probably uh add special hours but we'll see <laughs>